There you go. I just tried to hit block. Like no cream like All right. G of x over f of x. That's exactly what the notation represents. That's it, over there. All you guys had to do was take one function and put it over the other function. Now, what I taught last class period was simplifying by factoring. But in this example, there's nothing really for us to factor. We can't factor 2x squared plus 3. And we can't factor the 4x minus 1. Now, yes, you could look into division right, by using long division or synthetic division in this case. But that's, that's not really going to simplify this any further. It's just going to give you um, another, it's going to give you a quotient plus a remainder. right? It doesn't evenly divide. Does everybody agree if anybody tried that? You'd see it doesn't evenly divide. So it doesn't really simplify this anymore. So therefore, this is what we call our simplified form. Yes, always look to factoring like I taught last class period. Look to see if you can factor it so you can simplify it more. But this case, we can't do that. Now the next thing is to do our domain. So our domain, we talked about two restrictions. The two restrictions are, if you have a variable in the denominator, the variable cannot make your denominator equal to 0. Or if you have a variable under a radical, that variable cannot make your, ver uh, not make your radicand less than or equal to 0. So we have a variable in the denominator, right? So all you're simply going to do is take your denominator and set it equal to 0. We want to find the values of x that make our denominator equal to 0. Because can those values be in our domain? No, those values cannot be in our domain. So we add 1 to both sides. 4x equals 1. Divide by 4. Divide by 4. x equals 1 fourth. So when x equals 1 fourth, when x equals 1 fourth, we get 0. We don't want 0 in the denominator, correct? Because 4 times 1 fourth is 1. 1 minus 1 is 0. You can't divide by 0, correct? So the only restriction we have on this graph is x cannot equal 1 fourth. Every other number is OK. The only numbers based on your restrictions is x cannot equal negative 1 fourth. So in this case, you have all real num or your domain would be all real numbers such that x cannot equal 1 fourth. Now, if I was just going to switch those around, I did this, uh, I did this video in the other class. 